There are a few things more distressing to a breastfeeding mom than having a sudden drop in milk supply. Whether you're pumping and all of a sudden you see that you're producing a lot less, or you're nursing and your baby is just not seeming like they're getting very much, it can be really stressful. While there are various reasons why this might happen, in this video I'm going to share some of the most common reasons why your milk supply may have suddenly dropped. My name is Katie Clark and I'm a certified lactation educator. I love sharing breastfeeding tips with moms around the world on my websites Clark's Condensed and The Breastfeeding Mama. Be sure to press subscribe and the notification bell so you never miss a video. Reason number one is stress. Now stress in and of itself is not going to drop your milk supply. However, the effects of stress, not eating enough, not drinking enough, not getting enough rest, and just kind of sometimes for even forgetting to breastfeed or pump may be causing your drop in supply. If you've noticed a drop in supply, definitely analyze your stress levels and make sure that you're taking care of yourself as much as possible. You want to make sure you're drinking enough, eating enough, and that you are nursing your baby as much as, you po as they possibly can. Number two is hormonal birth control. A lot of moms will come to me and say, my milk supply just dropped. And as we talk, I discovered that they started a birth control. Now there are birth controls that are progesterone only, and those typically are more compatible with breast milk and won't always drop your milk supply. However, if you're using a birth control method that has estrogen and progesterone, that will often drop your supply. So you may want to talk to your doctor about getting something else. I have talked to a lot of women who have used Mar the Marina birth control and seen their supply drop. That is progesterone only, so I'm not sure why it happens, but it hap has happened to a lot of moms I've talked to. So if you just started the Marina birth control, that might be something to consider as well. Reason number three, your period. A lot of mothers will see a drop in supply when they are when their period returns. For some babies, they don't notice or they don't really care as much. They just kind of work at it a little bit more and get more milk. However, for some babies, it can be really stressful, especially if the milk, the letdown doesn't come as quickly. One way you can combat this is with magnesium and calcium. I'll post the exact amounts below, but taking those right when you start to ovulate through the first couple days of your period can help to counteract the effect of your period on your milk supply. Reason number four, have you started a new medication recently? Well, most medications are pretty compatible with breast milk, with breastfeeding. There are medications that can cause a drop in supply. I recommend the app Mommy Meds because it will talk a lot about if they've seen any noted side effects with breast milk and supply with certain medications. One very common medication that will drop your supply is decongestants, especially if they have pseudofederin in them in them. That can that is something that a lot of people actually are recommended to use when they're trying to dry up their milk supply. So if you are taking a de decongestant, make sure it doesn't have that ingredient because you don't want to make it dry up your milk as well as your sinuses. Reason number 5, oregano, sage, parsley, and mint. Now, don't go throw all of these out of your pantry because in small amounts, they're usually fine. However, if you're eating or oh, consuming a lot of these ingredients, particularly in vitamins that they might be in that you may not have realized, it may be causing a drop in your supply. Again, this is one of the less common reasons why I would, why I would think your milk supply is dropping, but it is something to consider, especially if you've been having a lot of oregano recently. Reason number six, have you had a sudden change in your eating or drinking habits? Not eating or drinking enough can affect your supply and you want to make sure that you're eating at least 300 to 500 extra calories a day to make sure that you're making enough milk with the right nutrients for your baby. If you've gone onto a sudden crash diet or something that severely limits your or something that severely limits your calories, that may be a reason why you've dropped, had a drop in supply. Which brings me to reason number 7, sickness. Sometimes when you're sick, you might be eating or drinking less, which can cause a drop in supply. However, you may just not be feeling well and not nursing as much, which can also in turn ca cause a drop in your supply. If you're just not nursing frequently enough, your body may think you don't need to produce that much milk. And finally, the last reason is just not nursing or pumping enough. I've mentioned this throughout this video, but that is the number one reason why I see a drop in supply is when a mom doesn't nurse or pump enough. For instance, if you give a bottle and you don't pump, that can actually cause your milk supply to drop because your body's not thinking that you're, ma you're making milk at that time that you've given the bottle. Or if you're just not nursing frequently or not nursing on demand, that can cause it so your milk supply drops as well. Now, if you have had a drop in your milk supply, try not to be too stressed out. There's almost always a way to recover it, and the best way to do that is just to increase stimulation. You have to move milk to make milk, and if you are having a sudden drop in milk supply, I recommend just having a nursing vacation where you just nurse your baby all day long, or you power pump at night, which is where you pump on and off for 10 minutes for about an hour. 
Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. And if you want to check out more reasons why your milk supply may have, may have dropped, you can go to the link in the description for this video. Don't forget to subscribe and press the notification bell so you can get more of our videos in the future.